some of the hardest parts of cold camping is taking your dry clothes off that you sleep in and get into your cold clothes but one of the park rangers said he'll take our stuff to the boat which is awesome because it's kind of a far drive but this is camp wrapping it up I had to put these away but uh now I'm cold, but it's supposed to be up to 60 today. So I just got to get through the coldness. And now it's 32 degrees. I'm still rocking my wool boots as long as I can. But uh, we'll see on the water. All right, we are on the water. Mr. John's. There you go. We back in the game? Yep. Down? Awesome. Down, there you go. John brought my rotor down. I appreciate that. So, day five and Swanee River State Park. I think, John, is, um, I think this is the one where if this was full, we can actually camp. There's primitive sites on the other side. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. Um, I would probably recommend that over doing this. Um, just because, but, so you're not having to do all this hiking. Um, I don't know if I would want to do that again. People are pretty awesome. It is 36 degrees, and I'm cold. My feet are wet. No, we're going to Dowling, which is right about 15 miles. Um, it says 3, 6, 9, 12, 13, 14, 15. So about five hours of kayaking. It is um, uh, 9.45 right now. And, uh, today's high is supposed to be 60, so come on, sun. Get the sun out. It is freaking freezing in the wind. <sighs> Sucks. Um, it's not real bad, but it's just cold. But, um, back on the water, though, man. Which is awesome. We'll take a look at what we're looking at. right now uh luca chuka or something like that such an l i can't pronounce these names um but uh yeah this is a another river feeding into the swanee right here girls already there they're out this thing's trying to turn me on um, so we could get them on the water then we could get ourselves on the water but yeah super cool beautiful day just cold a little bit windy
looks like there was an old bridge here before. I don't know if you can see that, but that's cement pillars right there. And there's some more over there, so that probably was a, a much older bridge here at one time. If you ever want to know what underneath the bridge looks like, this is pretty cool. I'm always looking up and up at them. for 60 minutes it's 48 degrees good direct sunlight and uh, by four o'clock it'll be 60 so I had to come out of this close let everybody's paddled ahead to get caught back up When you stop paddling, it stops. It stops your boat. But, all right. I will see y'all when something cool happens. All right, guys, we are been paddling for two hours. Um, the heart rate's at 106. Watch telling me that I've burned up 727 calories. <laughs> I don't really care about that type of stuff, but it's kind of cool to know, I guess. But I, I've downloaded this app called Paddle Paddle, and it tells me can you see that? It tells me how fast I'm going, my average miles, it maps what I'm doing. So I'm going about five miles per hour, and it's dropping right now. I'm actually. Uh, going zero miles per hour at the moment, but on average five miles per hour paddling um, When you see it the crappy thing is You're you're driven to look at this and see how fast you can go and nobody else is looking at it So I'm killing everybody behind me um, But um, Super cool app. I like that We should be 
uh, at camp. 12, maybe an hour and a half. So, here comes John. He's over there. Here's John. Hey, buddy. The girls are behind me. But, uh, all right. Not much to see. I'll show you what we're looking at. Man, it's beautiful, but... This is it. I don't want to document a bunch of river time. Unless something cool happens. Beautiful. Anything else happens, I'll let you know. I'm out here for two hours, not really seeing much. And see something cool like this is neat. The water gets so high up here. Oh, look at that. It's a pretty house. Looks like it was built in the 70s. Really pretty. Here we go. So. Gotcha. So this is Advent, Advent Christian um, Village, and there's some like restaurants right in here, um, and uh, the down is on the right of us over here, so you could actually get set up camp and then come across the river and eat. Uh, there's the spot right there. Remember that? It's right there on the left. So, so this is where you can walk up and go up into the village. Um, and Dowling is right over here. I'm going to take a seat right now. Um, yeah. It's an old folks home. I want to say old folks home. It's like for elderly people or whatever. So the food there is cheap. Last time I was, uh, um, last time I was there, like, uh, a double cheeseburger, fries and a sweet tea was like seven bucks. And then for lunch, or breakfast, I got two eggs, grits, biscuits and gravy, coffee for like $5.99. It's crazy how cheap it was. But yeah, there's a, there's a sign there. Um, Advanced uh, Christian Village. And you can actually stay there. So there's a hotel. But over here on the right is free camping. Uh, and it's those little um, um, screening torches. This is really cool. Should be here on the right hand side here in just a minute. Take it with me. Um, this river has changed since the last time I've been on it. Um, but the lunch, the dinner doesn't start until I think four, so um, we have. Um, And right now it's one o'clock, so I'm get up, get set up, get everything charged up, and then paddle over there for dinner. Um, so I didn't have breakfast. I had like a little meal uh, meal replacement bar, and then Gatorade. But uh, that's right here on the right hand side. I'll show you when we get there. Uh, all right, here it is. 
and uh, just past the, that village. This looked a little bit different last time we were here. Um, looks like people maybe came in or came out just looking at the footprints. Now this is Dowling. I like this place because we get to have like real food. We paddle back over and have breakfast in the morning. <laughs> That'd be awesome. But uh, all right, I'll show you. Here. Where do you want me at? Right, point right at his feet. Do I just paddle like. Yeah, paddle down? normal. We'll get you in here. Just like you're coming in the old van right here. It's okay. It's okay. I got you. I got you. Come on, paddle. Huh? Yeah, it is. Yeah. I'll back you well. up, and then I'm gonna put you right here, and then I'm gonna bring you on. Here. And here. I'm gonna step up and sit down. I'm seeing tires. Oh yeah. I forgot about them. You think my pad will be okay? Yeah, I think so. I didn't. Well, I didn't know if that thing was all wet this morning, and I thought, did it rain? I don't want my seat to be wet. There we go. That should be enough for us to get all on the path. Yeah. Ugh. I'll grab your pad. All right. There's that. There's the uh, um, dollies up there. Done and done. Let's figure this thing out. Let's go hop up here and see what's going on. There's your cart. It's dowling. This is so cool, it gives you mile markers. That's your cart. This stuff is free now, I remember that. Look at this. This is a place for your boats. These are on stilts. Some of them, which are cool. Got free electricity. They're, they here? I don't see anybody. There's no water anywhere. So we'll have to we'll put you water we're gonna have to. Get it from the, what's the name? The river. From the river. <sighs> so, there's no water here this time. Um, I think because there was some flooding. But I think this is the one we stayed at last time, wasn't it? Up here? Yeah. Maybe that one's got plenty of hooks to it. Right. This is number two. Yeah. I think this is the one we stayed at last time. Number one has a lot of hooks as well. We're hammock campers, so we're looking for hooks. I think this is the one we stayed at. Um, I'm not oh. seeing a lot on this one. There's one on each side, but not. <coughs> yeah, this one won't work. This one won't work. This is pretty, though. This one won't work. That's no 
good. That one will work. There's a couple of them out here. They go all the way down. Yeah, there's like five at each place. Let's go. Um, well, if we find one, then we don't need to look anymore, right? All right. So we got one hook. There's two that are kind of close. There's three over there. Yeah, I got a hook here and a hook here. Oh, that's cool. I like that. Let's see. There's one there. It's just on the middle there. Yeah. I mean, we could go from here to there and there and that be in a V. Be a short one. Oh, from there to there? Right here, Mom. From right here yeah. to there. And then right here to over there. Yeah. That'd be a V. Uh -huh. That'll work. Yeah. We could do that. Do you want to do that or do you want to see if do you like that? Yeah, it's just so we don't have to carry our stuff so far. Mm -hmm. So, I think we found home. Your hammock camper. I think one. Would one work for you? This one will work for us. We can look at the other one. I don't know if you want to be up high. We'll look at the... We're going house shopping. We'll go house shopping with them. We'll go house shopping with them. It's not like you got to um, make your way back to the bathroom. Right. <laughs> no water. No water at this one. I mean, there is water, but there's... They're having water supply issues. They're having water supply issues. Oh, that one's right on the water, isn't it? Problem with the well, huh? Yeah. Did you guys see There's a wood at this one. There's wood at the uh, two, number two. What's that? Did you see a camp hose? No. There's wood. They make all these steps all your paint. Yeah. Is this one overlooking the water? Uh, no. Uh, no. No, I felt like it. It's all the screen right here, but... I gotcha. Well, it has a nice picture in it. Oh, boy! Yeah, I got a picture of mine, too. It's kind of nice. <laughs> um, yeah. They're all located in the centers. Yeah. yeah. So, this is a tough one. If y'all would rather be up, y'all can have the one with steps. We just thought we'd be nice and do the one without steps. Oh, no, they don't have it. This is cool. I mean, if you're going to be stuck in the rain. Right? <laughs> Uh, we have power. There's power. That's awesome. We're definitely going to take this firewood, though. There's firewood at the, uh, on two as well. This is... There's another one back there in it. That... See. This is five. All right, there we go. Look at this. This is cool. Sweet I don't see this one working either. It's like funky. They use all metal beads. Yeah, that was yeah. silly. There's, there's two right there. There's one there, so you'd have to share you that, could go one. that one. And that one. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, that I wouldn't want this. Though. I think these are beautiful, though. I know, right? I just got to fix the hooks. <laughs> Immediate potty spot. You can go pee pee outside the rain. Drop yeah. underneath. Just go. Oh, I was like, really? You're gonna find the best like crack? Kind of hard. You wanna check out six? I think there's one more. There's one more. I don't know 
And you don't think so? Is that one to the right over there? Little walk. You see the path over there? It's definitely a walkway. Well, if you're a hammock camper, one and three will work. Or if you've got a hammer and move these hooks around. But uh. Oh, maybe it's primitive. Primitive. Oh, there's another fire ring over there too. So they're. I think this is all. Yeah. Maybe the primitive area? That's primitive. Okay. Because there's a picnic table over there. Yeah. yeah. I've seen that. Isn't that a pretty tree? Yeah. So I bet that's it. This is the. This is One it. One in three. Do you guys have a preference? Nope. Nope. Which one you want? Yeah. I see you got a preference. I don't care. If you want to, be you want to be the birdhouse? All right. So we'll make a decision. We'll be back. heavy stuff. There's the cart. <sighs> All right. I'll show you when we get set up. Yeah. 
idea. We might go that way with it. Now I have all this room over here. under quilt. It's like a sleeping bag underneath. Changed it a little bit. Uh, because it was just gonna be so tight over there. Um, I got you facing out, so you need to go. go. You wanna do this? This is you right here, baby. Oh, going this way? Oh, I told face you face I face had you facing that way. Yeah. Yeah. Tonight is going to be like 38 degrees, um, which is going to be like a heat wave. Compared to last night, at least. Yeah. Well, I don't think we've slept in that warm weather hmm. yet. Where's the electronic box? I want to get some stuff. Right over there.
put in this one, my, the little one in there. Mm -hmm. Okay. And that's how you set up camp. We got, look, we got free electricity and ceiling fans if it's hot. This is all our electronics. All right. All right, I want to show you camp. I did a little bit of changing, but here's the chairs. It's a place where we'll have coffee. Um, but I moved where I hooked up one spot. We'll put on two right there. I just think that just works better. And we'll be camp there. Here. Crystal's head right there. Mine will be here. And this is our view. Still a little bit of a gear bone. And you get free electricity, which is, I keep showing you, but I'm pretty impressed with it. The fan, light. And electricity, so we can charge everything. But we're gonna, gonna get our shoes on and then paddle across the water and uh, there's food there, so we're gonna go eat. I'll bring you with me. All right. Flip this thing around. Oops. We are gonna go grab something to eat. We'll eat dehydrated food. And, uh, we'll bring the rudder down. There we go. So we're gonna go across the river here and uh, go get us something to eat. This is gonna be upriver. So uh, try to stay out of the current. But, uh, all right, so there's camp. We're just gonna go across the river. I'll show you that when we get there. Boat landing. Here's our boats right here. Uh, this over here by John. Um, you think her boat would be okay over there? I didn't. I didn't. wasn't paying attention. Let's put these rudders up. There we go. All right. So, let's get something to eat. I'm freaking starving. And it's this way? Yeah, Following the walking path. All right. All right. See, because of COVID, we have to get checked in, but just no big deal. And then we can eat. Um, which is side by side of each other. What's that? The restaurant's probably right there. Okay, that's the double doors. This is probably the, the restaurant's right there. Gotta go in the double doors. Oh, we'll be back. Where? No, okay. You don't. You just put that you're going to the dining room. Okay. Let them go for a while. Let them go for a while. If we um, were to come back um, tomorrow, you have to do the same have thing to, again. You have to fill this out again, too? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Are you staying here? No. We're across the river at yeah, the Dowling Park. Yeah, you have to come Park. back here each time. Okay. Sorry. That's fine.
see the prices? It's crazy. Or they doubled that order, I'm not sure. I know, I don't know that either. Yeah. That might be for both of you. <clears throat> she didn't tell me my temperature. Maybe I'm not, maybe I'm ill. <clears throat> Who's the hot one, you? Mm -hmm. What's she saying? 99.5? 99.8.6 is a fever. Higher is normal, so anything above that is a fever. Low grade. The 100 must be high grade. Yeah, when you hit 100 it starts being, I guess, high grade. I always figure that's probably why they're earmarking it. Good? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Being on the trail. That's why we didn't have town food. It's, a, it's town food. It's delicious. Town food. I'm double fist of water and Diet Coke. I mean, come on. Yeah. Killing him. Do I have my foot on it? Something hurt? <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. I got a kink in my neck. I got a kink in my neck, too. <laughs> That was delicious. Town food is always good. Uh, so there's supposed to be like a grocery store or something around here. You have to have a little visitor thing. They check your temperature. Uh, so once you go to um, the information spot right there, go. Mm -hmm. Walk through this way, and uh, the grocery store is just around this corner over here. You need a resupply. We'll see what that looks like. <sighs> Man, my belly's full. So just past the bank. Oh, hey guys. Hey, look. That is crazy. That's... You see that? You're okay, you're okay. Yeah. Huh. That was cool. But just past the, the bank, is the little shop here. Oh, I was like, dude, it's cold out in the river. I'm not coming down. So there's like a village grocery store here. You can resupply. This is day five for us. We got four more days, which we still got plenty of food. Um, I just need to get like a Snickers bar or something like that. And the camp that we're at has no water. We brought a way to filter water. But we might just grab um, a gallon of water. We'll see. Take a look. This is right on the Swanee River. Butcher shop. So let's go in and see what it looks like. Here's your hobby. Okay. 
neat little place. Yeah, that is a good. We don't drink a ton of water though, babe. We'll get one. I think we'll be okay. You don't want any of this stuff? No, we should be fine. There's tang. I've never had that before. At least I don't think so. Oh, That's cool. Look at this. Is it open? No, it opens tomorrow. Oh man. No. Oh. I'm upset. I'm upset. Oh, look at the Oh my goodness. Oh, a shot. Oh wow. Well. Like. I just want to see if they had hats real quick somewhere. Just gonna look for a hat. Look for a hat. This is like professional. I know, right? I mean, think it's a retirement home and we're in Florida. Right. Right. Everybody moves to Florida. Right. This is catering to them for show. The barber shop. Nice, nice shop. <clears throat> when is it open? Oh, it's like a secondhand store. Yeah, twice nice. I figured they might have hats. Uh huh. That's it. Monday, Friday. It's probably those fancy hats, too. This is cool. I'm sure, I'm sure they have fishing hats or even a ball cap will help. Yeah. <sighs> wow. This place is cool. It's right off the water, off Dowling. You get to stay at a place for free, which is really cool. Neat. Good food. This is like I said, an old folks' home. So, like that burger. Did you see the price of that? It was three ninety nine. That's crazy. And fries is extra. Drink is extra. But man, I've got some groceries. That's actually the river right there. But. All right, let's get paddled. Get back on the water. You see the water over there? That's where we at. We camp right over there. Oh. All right. We'll see you on the water. Before we go, those little cold sandwiches that you saw at the that little restaurant because it's still it's like 4 30 um we want to grab um a couple of sandwiches from here so we could have like regular food rather than dehydrated all right we got a few more snacks from the the grill and uh looks like she's got them And uh, let's go to the boat. I'm tired. Almost to the boats. I want to show you it's a car coming. Get out of the way. Where you put your boat, it just makes this easy for you guys. But uh, a little nature trail. there. And there's the boats. Yeah. Right. 
down there. We're taking the shortcut. This place is beautiful. Here's the water. I had to put on shoes. But, yeah. Man. Super cool place. I should check this out before we go. This thing looks neat. Memory 1882. Huh. It's pretty cool. I was burning up. I got a shirt on. And I'm about to freeze now. It's starting to get cold again. Get it back to the shop or to the house or the where we're staying and get uh get some warm clothes here we are missy's the smartest one she's got a jacket crystal's got a jacket me and john are retarded we don't wear jackets brought mine. <laughs> yeah we don't wear jackets <sighs> oh, i got you put us throw the stuff in the back sit on the back and then pull yourself in. You know what I mean? Yeah. I'm okay. Okay. You all right? Yeah. Uh, you ready? Maybe. There we go. All right. That's how you do it. <laughs> now, uh, me and John, we usually have to do this on our own. Where are we working? We're the support crew. We're the support crew. Mr. John's way. <sighs> All right. Get them. We are on the water, trying to. I don't want to hurt the paddle. Uh, you want me to grab uh, the back of your boat? Oh, we're oh, good, big guy. We are freaking awesome. <sighs> you want me to pop your rudder down, or are you good? Yeah, if you wouldn't mind. Yep, I'm right here. Got gotcha. you. She down? Yep. All right. All right. Paddling back, back is going to be. Dowling uh, retirement home. And this will be a much nicer paddle. We're going down. Much nicer. Got a boat coming. It sounds like. Or no? Is that car? Oh, let me get my feet pedaled on. There we go. Here, I'll touch it. Let you see what we're looking at. Shouldn't take us long to get back. Going up. Kind of suck. Jumping's in the jet stream. Looks like. With all this rain, we're at 9,600 CFMs. Uh, when we first started, 
um, yesterday there's 9,000 so 6,600 more CFMs the water is definitely hustling Get the blood flowing because it is cold. It's under 59 degrees. I'm wearing a t shirt and the breeze. I don't know what it's supposed to feel like, but I'm sure it's colder than that. That feel like temperature. Coming in hot, coming in hot. There we go. Gotcha, bud. Boom. There we go. All right. Bram. All right. I got that up. Here comes Miss Crystal. Dragging you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right. Get our stuff. My little visitor tag. Right there. Sounds missing. Oh, sorry, buddy. Oh, no Nailed it. Better than last time. Sorry, John. All right, let's get this stuff up to camp. I only have 1% on my battery, but Crystal said get your camera. you'll be able to see it. How do I make this? Can I make it go? It? No. I bet I can get it with my phone though. Yeah. So I'm gonna go grab my phone because my GoPro doesn't uh, zoom very well. There's a really pretty owl, a big one. So I'll go grab it and I'll show you but it'll be on my phone. So I'll be right back.
This might be a smoky fire tonight. All this was underwater. Um, so all the wood is kind of wet. But, uh, it'll be good to be off the, just off the water for the rest of the feet. Tomorrow we're going to do a zero because it's going to rain all day tomorrow. So it's just a rest day. <laughs> 